Alright, so today we're going to be working on my other car, which is behind the house. Um, we're going to be, basically, the sunroof cassette has been in there for far too long. It's just extra weight, I don't need it. I need to get that stuff out anyway, um, in preparation for putting in a moonroof, as opposed to the stock sunroof, um, which has already been removed, at least all the, like, unboltable stuff. Um, but... The rest of it needs to be cut out, so we're going to be using an angle grinder mainly to get all that out. Um, and that's basically today's project. Well, here is the car and my ugh, horrific pile of parts. So first things first, got to take the cover off. So yeah, this is the car as it stands. Um, if you don't know, it's got a 12A Mazda rotary. In the process of being swapped, right now I have motor mount, radiator is in, uh, transmission is in, transmission is mounted. The only thing right now is I don't have spark, and it's kind of wet in here, it's just condensation. Um, but anyway, that's besides the point. So right now, basically this is coming out for good. It's kind of difficult to do this with one hand. Basically this whole thing here is coming out and all of this guy back here. So this huge piece, it's all going to be removed. So for the sides, I need to go from underneath. Um, it's probably best to just do everything from underneath. But I guess it's less glamorous. Well, it seems to be going fairly well. Cut back that far. I know my angle grinder cuts aren't straight, okay? I'm not straight, so that could be something to do with it. Um, I've never been good at having an ang at using angle grinders. I've only had one for like not even a year now, so there's that too. Um, not really my favorite tool in the arsenal, but sometimes they're the best tool for the job.
Well, this side is going quite a bit better. Well, for my standards anyway. Well, it's almost out. Now we're making progress. Well, there's a big piece of weight that we don't need, so it's going out. So we have a lot less weight, there's just kind of the edge of it left now, um, which I'll eventually clean this up more, but for now, it'll do. There's a few other things I want to do, like I want to get rid of these hoses here. They need to go, there's, there's a, two on each side. Yeah, I did just angle grinder through a hose. What about it? More weight, we don't eat. I think the back ones might actually be attached in the trunk. Yep, as I thought, it's attached. Right there. The other one, I already removed, so we're good on that. I just need to, um, just need to, I'll just cut this out, I guess. So it's me from the future, so I lost some footage. Um, but basically, so I cut that out, as expected. And um, this thing was sitting um, in here, and this locks the fuel door. And I have no use for this, so this is this also got unbolted, and this will be being removed, as you would expect. Well, that's the end of the video. Um, it's about to start to rain. So we have to wrap things up. Um, it's fairly good progress. I kind of started late. So it is what it is. Anyways, see you next time.